Yeah, I'm going to fall. I wanted to do that because of one particular thing. Yeah, needed to do it again. God, I'm not very good at uh, these parkouring things, am I? I pressed X. I pressed X. I honestly pressed X. Right? I'll let it come down. And wait a minute. Oh, it goes up then, does it? Right, so, jump, glide, jump, and jump. jump on. Yes! Yes! Thank goodness. Yep, yeah, um, we sort of are. There we go. Right. There and on here. Seth, come on. Yes, I am looking at this. Fingers crossed. Oh, what's this? Uh AP3 torso, AP3 legs. What is the AP3? Uh, I think I can break those. Right, we're on here. We've got the checkpoint. Yes. No. We did it. And um, what's that? It's Kai's Crawler. No thank you. <laughs> yeah, I want that audio track though. Those evil robots in the movies we used to watch would always say, Humans are imperfect and dangerous. They yes. must be destroyed. Yes. But that makes no sense. I mean, the robots are imperfect too, right? Otherwise, why would they attack us? Yeah. What I mean is, perfection. It's the wrong goal. What really matters is balance. Mm-hmm. When I started to design the AI for the cores, I didn't try to make a single perfect intelligence. Instead... I designed three separate personalities, a brave one, a fearful one, and a cheerful one. And to keep them straight, because you know how messy I can be, I gave them different colors. Red, yellow, blue. And my hope was okay. that together, these personalities would form a balanced group. Yeah. would be perfect. <laughs> but they wouldn't try to destroy us either. Yeah. 
Um, I got the blue and now yellow. So yellow is probably fearful. Treasures inside, two prismic cores, uh, nine chests and one health. Yeah, sure, let's, let's go for this sort of thing. What could horribly go wrong? No turning back now. Nope. What could go wrong? Hmm. I wonder. Yeah, doing uh, doing Seth is hard. <laughs> I mean, my my hands are just sweaty. Core foundry found the extractor. called the Core Analyzer. I don't have access to the Foundry Blueprints, but I'll do my best to guide you there. Sounds good. Mac, Seth, let's go. Right, guys, uh, I'm going to leave that there. Right, guys, I'm going to leave that there for now. I uh, hope you've enjoyed the session. Uh, Please like, favorite, and subscribe if you have, and I will see you in the next installment of Rico. Bye. you say another one bites dust Bench blueprints speed DR spider 
Hey, <laughs> bulldog, bulldog. Level fifteen. Blueprints, canine blueprints. That one's got it. That one's sweet. Actually, I'm researching Perfect. all I can. Mark, you're going an upgrade. Oh. Yeah, that's a bulldog, <laughs> really. Stick one of those. This is for the Okay. Muscles. Oh, 
Yes, I know that. Let's do this, Violet. So that is here. Yeah. Hi, Seth. What happened to you, mate? Come on, Seth. Come on, Seth. In we go. Yeah, we will get this, so. This place looks wrecked. Yeah, it does. It does look wrecked. By the way, hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Recore. Where we have Seth, our spy bot, and we are going up here. Because why not?
Why not? Let's open this. Ooh, blue spider legs. Nice. Um, yeah, I don't think it meant for me to get up where I did. But I did, and I did it. An empty cell box socket. Yeah. The guy must be around here somewhere. Somewhere. Hi, I'm in some kind of crush pit. You're on the right track. Just have to get past the grinder. Grinder. Does that hit me? No. There you are. Come with me. Yep, 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 lower, lower, there we go. There we go. Ah, small like it. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Come on, pull, pull, pull. Don't be afraid. They're gone now. Come with me to your socket. That should open up the yeah, rails. Grind rails. When did it oh there's something up there then? Nope. Okay, we could have just gone that way. Certain materials are essential for the core production process. While rare on Earth, the crystalline structures we needed were a plentiful supply of Far East. Yeah, I got it. December 2083. It was good to rest, but even better to wake and see all the progress the core bots have made. The foundry is up and running, thanks to Victor, mm -hmm. and exceeding core production targets. The pylons are ready for activation, and I've received news from the evacuation ships. They're safe, and about to start deceleration into the Far Eden system. Now that the communication lag is only days instead of decades, the Mandate wants to send me a large data package. Firmware updates for the core bots. I'm not sure what they've created that they think will improve on my original design, but no matter. It's time for me to wake the other crews. I'm ready to tell them about Earth, because now, for the first time, 
I truly believe Far Eden can succeed. What? So the robots went against the humans and created their own cause then. <sighs> um, what the hell is this? What the hell is that? Oh, right, that's our thing. Look out, those four by current attack mode. Right, so that's done. Attach. Can I use this console? Oh, see what this console does. Okay. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Um, what is it now? Can I jump up there, sort of? Yes. Okay, we found a way up. Alright, that seems this. Let's try staying on it then. Okay. Alright, you need to do that as we're going round. What? Right, I get it now. I do get it. Use it. Yeah. So you do that. What? It won't let me. Right, I have a limited time to actually attach to it. Is this another grinder? Grinder 2. Right, I need to do that, that, that. Okay, I got it now. <laughs> 